Okay, let's get to this other side. I'll just show you the whole thing real quick. This is a pre runner to rally upgrade. Well, halfway through, it looks freaking sweet. Ground clearance isn't really that much different, seemingly. Not going to affect where I'm running. The weight, I just weighed them. It goes from about 24 grams to about 12 grams. So it's half the weight of tires, which I like the sound of. Got these little rally hex hubs that fit into the axle slots quite nicely. Then open this next set of tires, which axle hubs, tires, a bunch of different colors. I just went what they had a four set of. It's going to be pretty cool. So. Try to spin them in. So you want to hold it. These tires don't matter. They're not rotational looking. Gotta draw that axle all the way in. Don't be afraid if it just spins. Gotta draw the axle in. Give it a couple little tugs. That's it. Last tire. Here. Spin it out. Put it off. I'm just putting these to the side because obviously I want to go back to those sometimes. Depending on where I'm running. Right in the groove. So make sure you spin the axle into the spot. Still got our screw. With these metal axles, kind of be careful that you're starting it correctly. Hold the tire, draw on the axle, tight, couple tugs, there you go. Wow, looks sweet. And I'm just going to fab that body that I just got to get rid of. Where's the front? Where's the front? I have to fab it a little bit, but it really is going to work pretty easily. Then we're going to try to hit 40 miles per hour. Thanks for watching, guys.